Hello, what's going on? Uh, Phantom here for another playthrough. Um, this time we are playing Final Fantasy, uh, not Final Fantasy, uh, Age of Empires 4. <laughs> oh my god, because I had 4 in it, I'm thinking of Final Fantasy right now. I was, I was about to say Final Fantasy 14. Anyway, uh, moving on. We are playing uh, Age of Empires 4. Um, and it is 4, it's not 14. Okay, uh, so I went through the settings already. I had to skip, I think, the tutorial part. Um, but, uh, yeah, so we'll just go, I'll just show you some setting stuff. Um, and yeah, so controls, I haven't really like dealt with anything. Um, game is going to be intermediate difficulty for the campaign. I might change it if it gets like really annoyingly, you know, uh, just really annoying or difficult. Um, yeah, 1080p, ball full screen, lock mouse to window. I might change this because I have my mouse so it goes off to my second monitor. Um, but I might change it because that's how you kind of move around the edges, but usually I just do right click um, to like move um, But anyway, 60 FPS um, It is 1080p not 4k because I don't really have a f anything like 4k um, like monitor wise, so um, So yeah, and I don't it don't I won't, it won't be like recorded in 4k either so that would just be pointless um, and yeah, audio online. I don't think I'm really gonna play online really, but I've got subtitles on movie and in game um, We've got the subtitle is default which is the smallest so hopefully it's not too bad um, And yeah, so like I said, I kind of skipped the tutorial part um, I wish we could just like re-enter the game and do it again, but I don't think you can um so I guess this is probably a tutorial here. So we might just do the tutorial, just get rid of, uh, just to get like refresh my brain and all the uh, keys and that. Um, it's been a while since I played an age game uh, or an RT, like a RTS in general. But Jesus. Um, so, so we have a bunch of a uh, bunch of different people here: English, Chinese, French, Holy Roman Empire, Mongols, Rus, Delhi Sultanate, Abbasid Dynasty. Um, the only fundamentals of, of uh, age four uh, would be town, uh, good refugees within township, claiming lands from invaders, clean lessons, and economic. Okay, learn advanced techniques, out of all challenges, available in single player sections, hotkeys, and age of for a critical advantage in your game. Green manage a growing economy, make split second battle decision, and get an instruction to the point of hotkeys. Um, what is this just like a reading? Does it send me outside? Okay, it does. It opens up a window outside the game. Um, oh, okay, interesting. H for, for town center. That makes I, I know a lot of these already. From age one, select from age two. Q, W, E. Yeah, okay. And then R makes sense. Q, 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 W, Q, E. Q, W, E. R A S D Z X C Y that makes all that's all makes sense okay. Uh, Out of villages is uh, full stop. There's nothing really for tab. Send to your camera is backspace. Bring up chat. I'm not really going to use. Rotate camera. Hold Alt and move mouse. Okay. Sections and units to a number. Control plus number. With the unit selected, to set multiple commands, shift plus any command. Okay. I think I'm going to use shift command a lot. Maybe rotate camera, maybe. Center camera, which is backspace, town center, H. Uh, units for number, I'm not really sure exactly what that means, but control number, item villages, full stop. Song through, select building type. F1 is military, F2 economy, F3 tech, then tab. Through groups by type. Units are different types. Uh, select units are, okay, then tab. Okay, I'll just keep that up, I guess, um, for now. Uh, while I just check some things here, seems to be not too bad. Um, so yeah, okay. And I guess this just opens up a uh, another tab, right? Okay, we we'll just do tutorial for now. Uh, 
Um, this is on the SSD this time, so if it's slow in loading, it's probably just because the game's large or something. Maybe it has to do with like the RAM currently, but it shouldn't be too bad. Okay, this is how it started earlier, I'm pretty sure. Yep, yeah, okay. This is what happened when Driven I opened the game. from their homes by armed invaders, a few hardy refugees faced the prospect of starting again. They would found a new village deep in the countryside. Alright, cool. We are starting. With a new oh, man, settlement it's established, feels so nice the to first play priority a game like this. was locating a reliable food source. The simplest source was gathering from nature. Just getting comfortable here, my bad. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Sorry, I get like really comfortable because I want to kind of like lay back a little bit during this game, um, since it's not like so an action intense. Let's fix this cord here, okay. Um, not to say not to say that this game doesn't get intense, but anyway, alright. Oh, okay, so that does that. Okay. Gather fruit, yeah. So then how do I okay, okay, mouse middle. Right, that's right. No, no. Right, uh, not right click. Okay. God, I'm, I almost forget how to fucking play this game. Holy shit. Oh my god, this is so, like, strange. I left click, then I then left click position or enemy. The current. What do you stop the current actions for A S? Drag one of the units to select them. Left click. Oh yeah. That. I'm aware of that. Yeah. See now this. Okay. So I definitely probably want. Uh. Where did I have it on the game? No. Graphics. Fuck mouse window. Okay, that's fine. Uh, plus 30 a minute. What's this? Gather a rally point? Oh, yeah. Man, bring with a healthy bring supply back of so food, much memories. the village could start to grow. To do so, it would need more hands to share the work. Uh, 50 wood. Okay. Four, five. It's about to a stack week. We can come back. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Here that. Eat your wheel. Huh? On rot. Wait, huh? Come get day. Wait, huh? Still ya eat. Yes, sir. Got some gold. Other villagers. Uh, huh? Okay. Wait, huh? On a resource or a building on a construction of this village. Yes, somewhere of that. I'm just exploring. I really don't like where the uh, where the mouse like pops up when you let go of this. The new workforce could now turn to the growing villagers' needs. First, they would build a mill near their food source. So villagers could drop off yeah, gathered yeah, berries more back. easily. Build a mill? How do I build a... Ah. Oh. Okay, I, I guess I just can't yeah, build anything. Yeah. I want... So Q and W. Work 
Yeah, it's really awkward where the mouse like pops up. I kind of always expect it to like pop up in the middle of the screen. Next, the growing village would need wood to build with. It's not going to go too far. The growing community now had a steady supply of lumber. To make wood collection easier, villagers could erect a lumber camp near the forest. Okay, where's the uh. Don't need three guys on this. Uh, Q and E. Is this like, oh yeah, guys, this is like geography lines. See the, like, the latitude. Thanks to the camp, villagers no longer needed to travel as far to drop off lumber. The village now required additional houses to support its growing population. Oh yes, 8 of 10 here, righto. So, Q. Q. Is this like the boundary? Go to three houses. Oh no, this is the edit. Oh my god, we're in the, like the very, very edit of the map here. Uh Work game day. Dawn. Wait, huh? Work game day. Ah, uh, that number shows how many I've got. Okay. With additional housing in place, even more villagers could join the workforce. But a populous village would soon exhaust the natural food sources. To grow, the community needed dedicated farms. Got three farms now. Jesus. Okay. Do I have any? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, make it near the mill, I guess. It's like a perfect, perfect square as well, which is awesome. I love it, man. My, nice and in line. I remember like old, like Age of Empires, like the mill would be like a two by two and then the farms would be like a three by three or a three by two or something like that. I think it was three by three and we had, you'd have to like do it like offset. So it would like, <laughs> it's like really like awkward. Build more farms. That's how I turn around, I guess. I don't know why I'm like exploring, but anyway. And I'll do it like I'll go straight across from here. Yeah, yeah. 
Oops. Um, three farms, okay. Work ten days. Should be good now. Establish economy. Woodsmen and farmers now kept the village well supplied. Further farmers. growth required knowing the countryside and finding more resources. For that, communities employed scouts. Bridges scout from here, I said W. Lamy cavalry, obviously self forest. I mean, it's where we can combat. Okay, well. Should we keep this guy here to, uh... Able to move quickly and see great distances, scouts were key to discovering new resources. The most important thing for a scout to locate was a ready source of gold. <laughs> Already done. Yes, Don't worry. Right okay, here. To prevent having to haul all large distances, expanding communities would establish a mining camp near the source of gold. Seems like this yeah. whole area is kind of fucked off. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And this is why I left this guy up here. Uh, strategically, I think this is the best place to put it. Or in the corner. You got four. Two. Yeah, then one away. Okay. Well. <laughs> I know all this stuff. I don't A think well -placed I. Camp ensured efficient gold mining. I'm not really learning anything from this. Which enemy. Enemy wall. I don't think there's any more to go because these trees are like blocking. Yeah, yeah. They're like forcing a path in the game, yeah, yeah. kind of. Yes, yeah, it's too steep. Yes, sir. Uh, got additional gold. How many? Yeah, I got nine. Have sixty. Okay. Um, what am I going to do? I'll have she here. With a good supply of gold, the village was becoming a large town. The signpost of this growth would be the construction of a large landmark. It worked. Management to feudal mate age, so we've got T. I believe the king is sealed on the uh, combat units by two every 1.5 seconds. Put a landmark to advance, put a landmark to advance the next age, okay. Huh. I believe kings. 400, 200, oh yeah, I can make that. Well, we've got. Uh, thing up there. I feel like we should probably make a wall here if we're able to, if we can, but I'm not sure if we actually can. This is a split here, so I guess we can make it here. So we can retreat to this side. Attract more villagers to it. Bushes. I saw this green. Okay, stand off the mark. What the hell is this? More gold. Yeah, yeah. 
much is this got to go? 51. With the landmark in place, the once sleepy village announced itself as a thriving feudal township. Uh, the townsfolk had been driven from their homes before, however. This time, they would defend themselves. The first step would be constructing a barracks for infantry. Three, I guess we can uh This is plus me. Once it had a barracks, the town could establish a standing force of soldiers. Ah, oh, receiving Simple enhancement. Simple infantrymen armed with spears were a common choice for these militias. Okay, influence them. Okay, so that's okay. That's much cooler. It used to just be convenience back in the day, like just because it was close. Wait. I'm not sure if that would count. We just be minutes like barracks left click on the stream and you know I'm Uh four five. Where's this scout? What's the scout What's doing? Nothing up here. Don't Wish I could zoom out a little more. be lacking that right now probably wood it's fine because he put that wood there uh are these are these guys idle or what looks like they're idle uh-huh uh we'll go Ten stream, okay. Didn't know how much time I had to make there. Uh, what's the what's this influence? What what kind of bonuses I do I get from like this circle here? Yank of castle bonus triggers an alarm when enemy approaches because the enemy is okay. I don't know if that, if that does anything. Um, right, so wood. The town now had a militia and could look to reclaim the lands lost to invasion. The invaders had blocked the road north with a stout palisade. Although spears were of little use against these walls, the militia could burn down the obstacle with torches. Kind of want to like. Seems to be like a wall, so I won't be able to like <laughs> uh, wood cut my way through there. Be funny if I could though. Uh, 
Uh, I'll give it a shot just for fun. Uh, Q E probably about here. Double click unit. Control when you create a control group of these selected units. So click or press one to reselect. Oh shit! Oh my god, that's amazing. How do I how do I get rid of that though? Shit. How do I get rid of that? Can I like not? Oh my god, I just I shouldn't have done this. Oh my god, okay, okay. That's six over here, we'll split half half. And then all of them can be uh, three as well. Interesting. Okay, our gold is really doing work now, so it'll probably work towards the wood. I kind of want them to go deep. I kind of try and like have them go like really instead of doing this fan where they would just get the closest one. I wish we could like draw a line to the middle so then they would just do like they would do like in a V shape and get all like all the trees like in a line so they get to the middle and so then I can go to the middle and then they can do his little circle so I put the mill in there and then they can the go outwards. Now reclaim their lands in the north. That's all, what I've always wanted to do. Like, I want to do a mill like right in the middle. So to get there, I wish that I could like direct them to like First, the just do a line and then a deal circle. With a lone sentry. So you like this, for example. Destroy them. Left click. Uh, left click. What? Left click attack move, then left click the ground near the enemy. Oh, like that. Advancing aggressively, the militia eliminated the enemy sentry. What's this? It is not currently standing ground. The invaders had a small so. cavalry camp guarding the road, but the militia was ready to attack. Near sending ground, uh, attack enemies within range, but do not chase unless ordered to attack. A unit that is standing ground is impossible for both allies and enemies. Oh shit. It shall help. Can I? Oh, hang on. Can I, uh. Can I, like. Trigger trig a formation of some kind? Uh, probably not. Anyway. were highly effective against cavalry, allowing the militia to win the day. All that remained was to destroy the invaders' stables. Uh, I only lost one guy. The invaders' cavalry post was destroyed, 
but other enemy Gallery positions are waited further Gallery up the road. Hostile archers defended the next camp, which would put spearmen at a disadvantage. The township needed cavalry of its own to deal with this, and so would need to build stables. To deploy that cavalry quickly, the town needed to build their stables near the front lines. Fortunately, friendly villagers came out of hiding and joined the effort. With stables in place, the town could field horsemen of its own. Uh, I can't make a lumber camp. Why does it not work when I go? The fuck? Yes, sir. Where's the wall? Yes, sir. Real weird, anyway. Each a worker. Yes, sir. Yeah, that's all. Gadri and they would do. Yes, sir. Where's the wall? Uh, I can still make a bunch of like villages, which I shouldn't hold out on really. Here are Oppa. I'm here, Oppa. Oppa. I didn't know they, these guys speak uh, Korean. Sheesh. Uh, what am I doing here? I'm. Uh, oh shit. Double click. Oh yeah, to take both of them. Horsemen will gather here and then. How many do I need? 15. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay, there we go. It's unfortunate that maybe I just don't know how to yet, but I kind of want to do a like a formation to make a straight line because then I can do V. No more village capacity, right? That makes sense. Let's get rid of all these first because. This is fine. We've got a lot of, got a lot of uh, things to make here. What? I don't want that. What is that doing there? Oh, I've got to hold it. Okay. Okay. What the hell? Let me ask the town count. now had a rapid light cavalry, skilled at harassing slower targets, such as archers. 
Where to put the farm? I guess I'll put it here. Teacher worker. Hendes commente. Quad surface, they. Here at offer. Each each a worker. That shoe lay bayo timbran. Work and day on. No, did we saying? Okay, let me to enemy archers. Hey, 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 over here. I'm guessing some of these might have like formation things or something. Where do I have 15? Yeah. How do I like select five? Maybe I, maybe I can't. There should be a, there's, there's definitely a way, but I just don't know it. Three different squadrons. Click the cavalry eliminated one, two, three, the enemy archers control. and moved on to destroying the archery range itself. Uh, you can have these guys healed over here. The invaders' archers and their camp were destroyed. A final enemy emplacement remained. One fortified with palisades and defended by spearmen. To deal with this target, the town would need longbowmen. First, they needed to build archery ranges in the area regained from the invaders. Once more, friendly villagers arrive to help. What? Oh. The archery ranges. Okay. Some That's shit going on. There you work that. You think to
I get rid of this. Okay, we're going to be careful because if I press zero, yeah, and I'll make him come over here. Kinda wanna in influence, but whatever. Um and how much do I gotta build? Not really sure. With several archery ranges in place, the town could add longbowmen to its forces. Accessible? The stupidest thing I've freaking had. What the hell? A strong force of archers could eliminate enemy spearmen at a distance, so long as they took the proper position. I don't know how to get rid of this. This command thing. Uh, select all units. Unit management. So loose unit types. Focus on selected units. Shift. Uh, select control group one. Add selected units to group. Focus on group one. Focus on control group one. Say control group one to selected units. Say control group one to selected units. Okay, I'm so confused here. Uh, 
uh, set. Okay, so selected units will be set to control group zero. Uh, clear control group. Oh, okay. So I'll go do no selection. So I'm just gonna. Oh shit! That what the fuck? Oops, that's my fault. Ah. I don't even know what I just did. I think I accidentally uh, pressed, uh, what's it called? Um, home, uh, home, whatever, Windows. Uh. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I got that down. Uh, select control group one. Add select units to the group. Shift. Okay, so shift and then. Okay, so I can add to the group by pressing shift. So if I select three. I can shift. Uh, that basically just lets me select. Okay, so if I do this. Strelborad, Sise. Lucas Mutten, 